Here we are in the Swedish um, suburb, the Stockholm suburb of Farsta, standing in front of this gigantic footprint, which represents the fossil fuel emissions, carbon dioxide equivalent of the average person living in Stockholm. As you can see, it's about 3.8 tons of carbon dioxide per person. And according to the plans for Stockholm, we should be going down to almost nothing by 2050. I'm here with um, Archie Duncanson, who we call Dr. Environment, who's here to help people ex um, change their lifestyles a bit and come with some um, ideas and advice. Archie, um, we've shown you the problem here, which is this gigantic footprint that we have. Yes. And we have very few years, basically, to, to reduce it. Um, what's, your, what's your advice to people living in, in the suburb? Well, this big footprint, it comes from our consumption. Consumption of everyday things like bottled water, single-use throwaway items, paper towels, napkins, plastic cups, and our energy in uh, the home, and hot water, and everything we consume. So we need to reduce our consumption, not live like uh, primitive cavemen, but mm -hmm. just cut out the unnecessary things like paper towels. Instead of paper towels, I try to find a rag or a cloth, something like that. Instead of bottled water, I just take tap water. Right. Simple things that we can all do at home. Make, right. We can live a, we can make our level be half or even less. We can go as far as we want. Just by looking around at these simple things, we're remembering that the things that make us happy in our lives are our good friends and our family, not a bunch of dumb things that we toss in the trash can every day. <laughs> Thank you. Cheers. Thanks, Archie.